Hey guys and welcome back to another video. My name is Frenzy Gamer, and I like to welcome you guys again to the Def World to Warlord series. As today we're going to do another set of PvP matches. Let's hope that it goes better than last episode because of that Jade. Uh, <laughs> it's actually Zax's friend, which is pretty funny. Um, however, here are the stats in case you guys are interested. In fact, let me just remove my webcam for a quick second, and while wow, I'll actually uh, join a match really quick. Okay. So, first of all, let's check the deck. You know, we'll, we'll just check the deck first. Here's the main deck. And here's the side, if you guys want to copy it. Um, and here's my stats, because lots of, lots of you guys keep asking for my stats. And honestly, I might as well just show it to you guys every video. Because, in all honesty, um, you guys ask it pretty frequently. So, here's the hat. Here's the robe. Here's the boots. Here is the wand. Here is the Athame, the Amulet, which is from Von Shane, Duelist Daredevil Ring, honestly, in my opinion, is the best one. Uh, here's my pet, which is the Red Ghost. We're obviously using a Death Culture for the stats, for like, you know, 3% damage. And we're also using this deck. And here are the stats, in case you guys are interested. So here's the damage right here. Here's Crit Rating, some Pierce, and then Pip Conversion and Power Pips, in case anyone cares. Okay. So, let's actually start this match because... Okay, so my dumbass literally just uh, removed the freaking... Um, stopped the video literally right when I was saying let's get started with the match. So, um, let's just get started with the match because I cut myself off. I don't know because I'm an idiot, I guess. Ooh, we got a freaking shad. That's actually poorly lit. Okay, let's do this then. Uh, let's see, we got a Kizma right off the bat. Let's go. Uh, let's see. We could use a Kizma, a combination of two spells. So, um, we got a Kizma again. Uh, we're not gonna need this. We're gonna go with a... We're gonna go with a Wing Sorrow to start things off. You know, just for the, uh, freaking, uh... Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna do it just cause laws. <laughs> okay, he's going for a Tower Shield. Obviously, that was pretty obvious. So, we're actually just going for a straight up Wing Sorrow just for the freaking, uh, weakness here. And then we got a strategy with the kismas that did pretty decent damage so uh i'm pretty proud i'm pretty happy about that i'm not proud of it not probably not the best best move but it is a move okay so uh let's see we're gonna keep that death blade draw once okay we get a death scarab that's pretty good and we're gonna go for a brace he actually failed pep so it is what it is that's unfortunate but you know it is what it is it's just whiz uh let's see he's gonna go for a one hit in fact uh you can tell pretty much straight up right there still does a pretty decent amount of damage oh my god Oh my god, a weapon cast! Who's freaking mans? No! No, get that off my field! Hell no! Nah! Nah, fam! Nah! Get that out of my field, pronto! Okay, let's see. Oh wow, uh, that's uh, that's that's great. Um, we're not gonna use the Kizma then. Okay, there we go. Tower Shield. Let's go with this really quickly. He's probably gonna go for a Storm Lord because I'm gonna see. Ooh, oh wow, Storm Shark. Okay. Not a bad move. That's actually better because now you could combo this with the Storm Lord. Let's do this. Let's see. You know, honestly, that didn't do as much as I thought. That's actually pretty depressing to see that. <laughs> That's actually pretty depressing. Yeah, I, I, I'm saying, bro. I'm saying. Like, low damage. That's like super low. That's extremely low. It's basically laughable. Okay, we're going to go for a, a freaking Minotaur. Yeah, we're just going to go for straight up hits because he's just going to uh, shield spam because, I mean, what else can he do really at this point? Okay, we're going to go for a deadly Minotaur here and then we're going to go for a combination set then. There we go. Boom. Do some damage there. And then we get a pretty good, decent 1200 damage right there. So all I need to do is just one more move. And that move is actually going to be maybe a poison. Or I could just go... If he doesn't go for a stun block, I could go for it just right now. So, let's see. We're going to go... Let's see. If he storm lords, um, it's pretty obvious he probably might. Oh, he didn't. Okay. Well, now he can't storm lord. <laughs> this man is going for another weapon cast. I swear, to, I swear to God, he's going for another one. Okay. I got to hit him like as fast as possible. Let's see. We got... He got a Shadow Pip. That's actually pretty scary right about now. And I think he's probably going to go for another hit. So we're going to go for a double headless here. Uh, I feel like that should do the trick. And if it kills me, it kills me. 
It's all, it's all in the end. If it kills me, it kills me. Okay. Um, I could go for a poison. That would probably be more of a better move. But I feel like I might die. So... And I could double headless, so it doesn't matter. I could double headless. So we're just going to go for a straight up hit here. Yeah, he's going for a straight up hit too, so we're going to go for a headless right away. Let's see how much this does. This is going to do a lot. He didn't crit. Unfortunately. Oh my god. How much damage is this? And he also got a weakness, so that's unfortunate. We're going for a straight up headless here, because, I mean, we can. We just can. There's no, no re other reasons why I'm using a headless, other than I just can. So how much is this doing? Can I crit? Probably didn't need the crit. Actually, I really did need the crit, I think. Let's be honest, it, it does do damage, but not as much. See? 1700. It's actually not that bad, but it's also not that great. He can't stun me now, which is great. And then, honestly, poison might actually do the trick. So we're actually going to probably go for a poison um, and see what's up. He actually has another Shadow Pip, so that's unfortunate. Uh, we're going to go for a poison, though, in case he goes for a Tower Shield. I doubt he's going to go for a Tower Shield. Um, I don't think it matters. I think either way it kills, but we're not going to waste TC. But you know what? We're just going to ensure the kill. Let's ensure the kill. So we're going to go for a Headless. I have plenty of Headless anyways. He's going for a glow bugs. That's probably not gonna kill. His Rizolka didn't really do that much. I'm I'm pretty sure he may have been using Pierce Enchants, probably. That could be the strat. Uh, we're gonna hit him up with the GG though, because Yeah, yeah, it's uh, not 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 doing anything. <laughs> That's not doing anything. Okay, well, um Yep, we're going for another headless, and that should probably do the trick here. That was uh, a pretty uh that's something. It was something. I honestly thought he was going to do a lot more damage with the, like, 72% blade. Yeah, that that was some match right there. <laughs> wow, that, yeah, that ranking says everything. Let's see. Uh, nothing important, so we're just going to leave. See you later, Dustin. <laughs> uh, so guys, I'm going to be waiting for the next match. Oh, shoot! Match just started. Don't worry, guys, I washed my hands. Before we begin this match. So, we're gonna do it right now. <laughs> in fact. And I'm just waiting to see if my sister calls. Um, she's actually not home at the moment. But, you know, uh, she's probably having a good time. I'm also having a good time, you know, just making bids. You know, I'm just doing what I do as a whiz. Uh, as a whiz head. I'm not a whiz head, though. I'm a gamer head. <laughs> That's my more preferred term, is a gamer head. We're, wow, we're going against these freaking lower levels. Okay. Um, are, am I doing rank PvP? Or, like, is my... Oh, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> my rank is that low. Yeah, that, that explains everything. Okay, draw once, draw twice, and one more. Okay, we got a blade. That's pretty good. We're gonna go for that blade real quick. And then see what it go how it goes. We got the blade pretty much right away. I mean, the death field's not useful. I should have discarded the death field, if you ask me. But it's fine. We'll just discard this boy. We'll discard that boy. One more draw. We got Kizma. We're gonna go with a another blade. Right off the bat. I'll be surprised. He probably yeah, he actually might attack me, actually. The more I think about it, he actually might attack me. Ooh. 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 25%. Ooh. 25%. Ooh. Look at that. 25%. Okay, one more try. We got a Deadly Minotaur. That's really good. Uh, let's go for a Tower Shield right away. Let's see what he does. I'm pretty interested to see what he does. We're going for a Tower Shield. Let's see what he does. He's probably going to go for, what, a Bone Dragon? Wow. Wow. This man's is like... Okay. Uh, that's an interesting strat you got there, my friend. Uh, let's go with this. We're going to stack the, stack the blades. Stack the blades. That's the strategy here. Stack the blades. What is he doing? What is this? I do have to remove these weaknesses, though, obviously. Um, yeah, this is a, an interesting strat you have here, my friend. Um, let's go with a, another blade. In fact, uh... Ooh. That's really good, but I don't really need that spell right about now. That's not the spell I'm looking for. These are not the spells you're looking for. Let's see what he does. He's going for... Who fucking knows? What? 
my my man's what are you doing i mean yeah you got an open shot though i mean congrats i guess literally did like no damage and i was wide open imagine if i had a fortify Okay, we're gonna go with this. Um, could use something really good. Uh, not that's not what I'm looking for. That's not what I'm looking for. But I mean, we'll take it. We'll take this one. <laughs> well, let's just go for this. I don't know what this man's is doing. All right, a set shield. What are you doing? Honestly, what are you, what are you doing? I want to know. I, I really want to know. Oh, there you go. There's the spell I'm looking for. Tis the spell I'm looking for. You know what? Fuck it. Go strike. I mean, it doesn't even matter. <laughs> this man could just do whatever he wants at this point. I mean, this man is pretty much dead. D E I D dead. Let's see what happens. What is, he, what is he going to do? What spell? What is this? What? What are you doing? Are you gonna kill yourself? Is that your plan? Is your plan to kill yourself? If so, you're doing a good job. Good job. You're doing a per terrific job of killing yourself. One, two, three. Remove everything. And we get an extra blade. Which is nice. We're very good. Now we have three blades that stack. Yeah, it's he's not gonna do it again. There, it, you you'll be so dumb to do it again. I'm just saying. You know that's pretty satisfying, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna go. We're gonna be a little different, guys. We're gonna be a little different. Go with a deadly. <laughs> Watch him triage. Think I was gonna bone drag him with all these blades, and then he realized that I'm actually bone drag. I'm actually just gonna go for a deadly minotaur and do a bunch of damage. And in fact, we got three blades on them. Wait, is that four blades? Ooh. That's gonna be a, a lot. That's gonna do a lot of damage right there. Oof! 327 through all that resistance. How much is this doing? Ooh! That is so satisfying! Ooh! I don't know what your strat was, uh, Blaze. Um, why am I even going against uh, freaking privates? It makes no sense. I feel like the game is just so dead that I'm going against privates. The game is so dead. That I can't actually go against good players. I have to go against really bad players. The Storm on the other hand, I don't really know about the Storm. I think he just messed up pretty badly. But, I mean, it is what it is. So, we'll be right back for the third match. Okay, guys. So, what I'm hoping is that this match is actually good. Because I'm getting tired of going against Privates the whole time. In fact, it actually kind of, in my opinion, in ways ruins the quality of the video. Because I'm not actually going against good players. I'm going against pretty bad players. Another pri- another freaking private, okay. <laughs> um, that's uh, that's- that's terrific actually. Um... I guess. <laughs> We're going against my boy Duncan. It's a storm though, anything can really happen with storm. You- you really can't- you really can't predict storm that well. Storm is just super random, very heavily RNG based. This guy actually might be really good just with bad rank. Or maybe he's just starting, you know? There's so many things that can factor in. We're going against a lot of storms, actually, so that's actually pretty bad. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. We could go for... Ooh, Wing Sorrow. Let, let's go. We're gonna go with that. And let's see, draw another one. Ooh, Headless Horseman, let's go. That's a, that's a good that's a good card set right there. That's a good card. Those are some good cards, my friend. Those are some good cards. Let's see what he's doing. He's gonna go for a Wild Bolt, trying to test his damage. TEST YOUR MIGHT! It's probably gonna do a lot, because KI wants to fuck me over. Actually, it did mid. It did mid. So it's actually not too bad. Let's go with this, Wing Sorrow. He's gonna do, what, 2k? Yeah, barely 2k. There you go, we got- you got the little weakness on you, bruh. My brother, from another mother. Uh, let's see. Remove this. And draw once. We got we got a TC Tower Shield. So we're gonna go with a combination strats. Let's see what he's doing. He's probably gonna go for another Wild Bolt. Yep, it's another Wild Bolt. This probably might do max. It did not do max. Good maneuver though. Good good move. Good move. 
Can I get an enchant though? I need an enchant and then headless. Okay, didn't get the enchant, but I'm probably just gonna headless anyways. Um, let's see. Can I get another headless though, or something good? Okay, that didn't get anything good. So we're just gonna go for a uh, regular poison, probably perhaps. Okay, about got bone dragon, but that's not really gonna help me much. So we'll just go for a regular poison to a headless. That's gonna be the strategy there. Um, if he shields, which I, I'm probably I probably should have hit it actually. The more I think about it, and look for another headless. But you know, it is what, what is this? Okay, you gotta be okay as a storm. You know, I mean he he still might beat me. Let, let's be honest, guys. RNG is definitely going to be on his side sometimes. Um, as a storm though, one thing I will tell you is yes rng is great you have to be kind of smart about it though you know you have to be kind of smart about it, knowing when to shield knowing when to do like certain things um that's just like an advice if you want to take it as a storm um again i don't really do much storm pvp so i shouldn't really have much of a say on it but i think that i have somewhat of a say on it but like i'm saying before if you're gonna do storm pvp be a little smart when it comes towards spamming hits you can't just spam hits and just you know expect a certain reaction to happen we're gonna go with a he's probably gonna tower shield this time so we're gonna go for this if he wild bolts though he's a god he's a freaking god this man's just a god he's a god amongst men oof you know the wild bolts is not on his side today that's unfortunate we we'll go for a Delhi Minotaur here. It's gonna do some damage. Let's see how much this does. Pretty curious. Okay, 75. That's actually pretty weak. That's pretty weak. Not gonna do much. They have thousand though. That's pretty decent. Okay, so um I'm gonna go and not use that. <laughs> Got a Kisma though. That's pretty good. We're gonna go for a set shield in case he wants to go for you know, he could go for a unsane bolt though, that's the thing. He could also go for Iron Solon, which is also a thing. Let's see what he does. Okay, he's still hitting. You know, RNG is going to help him eventually, right? It's going to help him eventually. Okay, there you go. There's there's the RNG right there. Um, That's just, that's a... It's a little crazy what Storm can do, honestly, sometimes. Okay, so we got the Shadow Pip. I'm pretty sure we lost, though, so... I mean, it is what it is. The RNG did eventually save him in the end. So, I mean, at least you got something out of it. I'm pretty sure this is going to be an insane bolt. I'm pretty sure this is insane. Oh, Storm Bats. Okay. Well, good match, because pre I'm pretty much lost this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's trolling. I mean, eh, it is what it is. It's just Wiz. That's your rank, dude. Oh, pff, that's your rank. Um, I lost. Yep, um, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna drink a water though. This is a good time to get a drink of water. I'm not mad though. Can you get a drink of water? We're probably gonna do one more though. We're gonna do one more because of RNG. My bad. I should have probably got my bag though. My bag had a lot more water than that. So, I mean, I guess. Um, yeah. I don't know. Not much I can do, really, because with death, you know, relied so much on blade stacking. Although the problem is, is that you can't necessarily blade stack against a storm. That's kind of the issue, is that you can't blade stack against a storm. So, like, in the end, it's like, well, either the RNG is on your side or not, so it is what it is. It's just whiz. Uh, we're gonna do one more, though. We're gonna do one more, so I'll be right back. Alright guys, and we're going in with another match. We're going against my boy Kane. Which is another deaf wizard. Hello, fellow necromancer. It is nice to see you. At least I hope he's a necromancer. Okay, so finally I actually get a first. Wow, we actually both get shallow pips. That's actually pretty fair. That actually is really fair. So good job, King Zal. You actually made it fair this time. For both of us. You made it fair. <laughs> okay, so two blades. We're gonna go for a Death Blade for the lulls, I guess. Um, and oh wait, he is a death, right? He is indeed a death. I'll go for a, a death blade though. He's gonna go for his own death blade. 
And I'm gonna need to look for a triage just in case. Most likely though, he's actually good at the game and he's gonna probably use something else like a Deadly Minotaur, which is something I would do. So, remove this. Give a draw once. Okay, so we didn't even really get what we need. However, we're gonna discard this. We're gonna draw one more time. And then we get a Kizma, so that's actually pretty decent. We're gonna go for a shield. And see what happens here. He got two Shadow Pips. He's gonna go for a set shield. Okay. Pretty interesting, pretty interesting move so far. Pretty interesting. And then we don't get another Shadow Pip, so that's unfortunate. However, we do have a Stun Block, so that's actually pretty cool. We're gonna go with that. In fact, um... I do want to keep some of these spells, but I think if there's one spell, I'm not going to use the Spirit Blade. And we're going to draw once. We do have a 60 Mantle, though, so that's pretty good. We're going to go with this. Just in case he needs, wants to go for a Stun Block. He cannot. And let's see what he does. He's going for another Blade, actually. Okay. Okay, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, so what we're going to do is that we're going to actually go uh, draw again. Got another Kizma, but we don't need that Kizma. And draw one more time. We got a triage. There we go. That's what we're looking for. That's the spell we're looking for. Tis the spell you're looking for. Yes, it is the spell I'm looking for. My good sir. Let's we'll see what he does. He's going to go for his own. His own. Version of Drake. So. It's the Battle of the Shrikes. Let us begin. Still deny the Shadow Pip. That's, fu that's fine though. He got another Shadow Pip. Wow. Wow. I didn't even need I didn't even notice till now. Okay, so we're gonna go for a he's gonna probably go for a spam amount of hits. So here's what I'm gonna do. Um I feel like what I should do is uh draw draw again. Okay, so I got that. I might actually use that instead of Kizma. Draw one more time, got another bone dragon. We're just gonna with the, go with this. He's gonna probably go for a bone dragon to uh to a shadow hit. Um uh, because I only have one shield right now. That's the thing. So I have to triage it off. Go for a Black Mantle, and then kind of go for a spam amount of hits, you know? That's going to be the strat there. So we got 45. He can't stun me, though. I can stun him if I want to, though. We're going to go for a Bone Dragon here. And then we're going to follow it up with a Mantle. Actually, if he Bone Dragons, we're going to follow it up with a Mantle. Um, not a Mantle. We're going to follow it up with a Triage, because it's either that... It's because I'm pretty, pretty much in a pretty tight situation right now. So we're going to see what he does. He's probably going to go for a Bone Dragon. Would be a good move. Yeah, he does go for a Bone Dragon. He's going to now probably go for a uh, Wing Sorrow. Um, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I hope that's what you call it. <laughs> and I honestly, I've been losing my Wiz terminology for a while. He does crit. Um, yeah. Um, like, that's great. <laughs> I love crits. <laughs> that are on me. Yeah, I, I love crits, bro. Crits are amazing. Don't you, don't you guys just love crits? <laughs> I think crits are amazing. They're probably the best thing that put or implemented to the game. Okay, so he does get that minus 10 backlash right there. Um, I'm going to go for a triage and then combo it with something else. Oh, we do get a shadow pip though, so that's actually really good. We got a shadow pip just in time, so we can actually Lulu. If we really wanted to, we can actually go for a Lulu. We got a black mantle, so I'm just going to remove the... Tr we're going to remove this tick. Um, that's going to be the strat. We're going to remove the tick and do something with this. And here's going to be the strat. So, we do this. Remove the tick. And then he's going to take another uh, loads of damage there. He's going to take 1104. He's going to probably go for a double Kizma. Let's see how much one Kizma does. Um, that's going to be the... That's going to be... Okay, so he goes for a Lulu. That's actually a better strategy right now than going for a Kizma. So, we're going to see how much Lulu goes. I think Kizma might actually do maybe like... What, 200 more maybe? So, we're going to see how much this does. And then we're going to add like maybe 200 to it. Let's, let's see what this does. This actually does 2700. We're going to think that Kismet does like 3k. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for a Lulu of my own. That's going to be the strategy there. Use a Lulu of my own and then go for a Black Mantle. That's going to be the strat. Okay, so I did get another Shadow Pip. So that's actually really good. We got a Vampire. We got a Lulu. So we have pretty much all we need. We're going to draw once though, just in case. We got a Green Shift Oak. So that's actually really good. I can just combo with that. Uh, we're going to go for a Lulu of ourselves. Um, he's probably going to go for a Shield maybe. So, I'm just going to go with this, um, for the health reasons, and then I'll probably go for a mantle, maybe even try the stun, if I can find one. So, let's see what happens here. We do have, uh, two power pips still, so that's really good. That does, uh, 2300. Get a hundred, get a thousand back. I'm, if he does Kizma, I'm pretty much dead. Um, it is what it is. Um, there's really not much I could do with that situation, though. 
So I'm just gonna have to go with what I got. <laughs> so let's see. If he Kismas, I'm pretty much dead. I could have went for a Black Mantle, but the problem is the Black Mantle, again, is like heavily RNG. Um, it, it, it's gonna be coming down to this. So hopefully, I'm pretty sure his Kismas does kill though. Yep, I, I think this is... Okay, guys, I think that's gonna be my last match. Um, I'm... I think it's just uh, not my time to go PvP right now. Uh, you can say whatever you want. I really don't care. But I don't think it's my time to PvP. Uh, I think I pretty much lost. Uh, this is killing. Yeah, that's killing. Wow. Um, that's unfortunate. Um, yeah. Um, I don't have no words to say, guys. Uh, it is what it is, though. Um... Honestly, I always feel bad when I do so bad in the PvP match because it's like I could have done so much better and it pisses me off because of you know the fact that RNG is so heavily a thing in Wiz that it really like when it goes against you it's just really really bad and like this in this episode RNG definitely went against me very hard I did get the shallow pips of course but this guy got so many more shallow pips and, I mean, I guess it is what it is, honestly. <sighs> it's just... I don't know. Sometimes, guys, I look at your comments. And some of you kind of annoy me. Uh, I'm going to be... I'm going to just be straight up honest with y'all. Some of you kind of annoy me. It's like, oh, you could have done this. You could have done that. You could have done this. You could have done that. It's like, okay, guys. I get it. Um, the only thing is, is that, in my opinion, hypotheticals do not help me. They're, they're not advice. I'm just going to let you guys know about that. Hypotheticals are not advice. They're hypotheticals for a reason. There's something that you know you should have done. There's something that you know what could have happened, but it doesn't happen because you know you had certain reasons why it doesn't happen. Maybe you didn't think about it, and then you eventually realize what you could have done. So all I'm saying, guys, is like hypotheticals does not help at all. In fact, I just it just makes me a little pissed because honestly, it's like it's stupid. Um, but. You know, honest, I don't know. There, there really wasn't much I could have done in those matches. Uh, most of it was just RNG. Um, it's unfortunate how I got all those losses. In fact, we got two, we got two wins, and then we went back down. And it's just, I don't know, guys. I, I just feel bad. You know, I just feel bad that you know I didn't do well this episode. I don't even feel like doing any more PvP right now. Um, after what's happening right now, it's kind of bullshit. Like. I went, I went against a Storm who just was basically trolling. I went against another Storm who, I don't know, for some odd reason he wins regardless. I went against the Death who just kept getting Shadow Pips like it's no tomorrow. And, I mean, it is what it is. And, you know, going second. Go, some of them I did, I did win first, but, I mean, it is what it is. However, guys, I think I'm going to be playing some other games right now. Uh, maybe something like, you know, kind of relax a bit from this because... Wiz PvP, I mean, is great, but sometimes it's complete garbage. <laughs> it is so heavily RNG, and it just pisses me off. But it is what it is, and you know, I just want to apologize for not getting any, not getting any higher. I feel like this is gonna be a, a really big struggle with the Death PvP series. With Myth, it was it was a struggle, but I mean, I didn't win matches because you know I didn't really rely too much on blade stacking. And with death, it's not that. You have to kind of rely on blade stacking in order to do very well. But, I don't know. It's like, all I'm going to say is that hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. I normally upload my losses because I want to show you guys that, yeah, you know, when it comes to World to Warlord series, everyone struggles. And there's some people who probably just upload their wins or upload their wins majority. But that's not really what I want to go with. I want to go with the fact that, you know, there's some struggles here and there. But in the end, when we get to that sweet, glorious Warlord, it's going to be worth it in the end. So, you know, it's just, you know, it's just not good. I, I, I'm i really, I'm a little pissed off. Like, I'm not really that pissed off. I'm just a tiny bit pissed off because how badly all these PvPs went. And like, you know, the strategies were not terrible. But it was the fact that RNG literally just uh, kicked me right in the face. And... It, it, I mean, it's just, it, it just is what it is, guys. And hopefully, you guys are patient with me when it comes to the War to Warlord series. I'm actually going to be playing some other games um, currently. Uh, hopefully, that will probably... That's going to ease my mind, for sure. I'm actually going to play some Spider-Man, so I'm really excited for that. And 
Again, this is really long outro. I, I'm like the king of long outros. However, I'm going to be doing some Spider-Man gameplay. I'm also going to be doing this Spiral Trilogy gameplay. So hopefully I see you guys there. It's going to really mean a lot for you guys to support those. Um, obviously, Kingdom Hearts is still going to go strong. And uh, another thing I want to let you guys know is that I do have a Twitter. So if you guys are very interested uh, for knowing up updates about videos, updates about like, you know video plans or just anything in general, uh, make sure to follow me on Twitter. I actually just made the Twitter two years ago. But I never used it. And now I decide that, you know what? I should probably use the Twitter because many people have been telling me, hey, use the Twitter, use the Twitter. It's a great way for you to expand your channel. It's a great way for this. It's a great way for that. And I was like, okay, well, I guess I'll just make the Twitter. And I I did remember that I made a Twitter two years ago with the idea of like, you know, promoting my channel and stuff. But now, but you know, I didn't do it because I didn't have much subscribers. Now that I'm getting close to 300, I was like, okay, I'll just make a Twitter. And I realized that I did make a Twitter, so I, I'm using that currently. So, again, if you guys are really interested in knowing updates and stuff, because sometimes I'm not going to let you guys know through a video, because more than likely I can't make the video, so I can just update you guys on Twitter. Um, it's going to be both my personal and YouTube Twitter, so, you know, it's going to be a lot of fun. So if you guys are interested, the link is going to be down in the description so you guys can follow my Twitter. As always, though, hopefully you did enjoy this video. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't, and as always, remember to stay frenzied. Peace! Tell me how you down.